why 73 grams of sodium sulfate uh, is dissolved in 250 milliliters of water. So you got that. Okay, so you have so many grams. It's just a salt. And then what we do is we take a piece of this. We take 25 milliliters of that solution. It's going to have the same molarity. We're just taking a piece of it. So the concentration won't change. We're just taking some of it. Um, and this, now, this new solution that's the piece of the original is diluted down to 500 milliliters. Uh, and I want to know the concentration here of the sodium plus ion. Okay, did you want me to go through all the math or general overview? What would be most helpful? Well, no, wait, was it you? Wait. It was me. It was you, um, yeah. Kind of some of the math of yeah, it? Yeah, some of the helpful? math, as long as it like, just shows like how to do it, I guess. Sure, no problem. 21.73 grams. We want molarity. Let's go straight to moles, okay? Mm -hmm. So you'll need to find out the molar mass of this compound, and that'll give me moles on top to get the molarity I'm going to divide by liters, and I'll just change it to 0 0.250 liters right off. Okay. And that's the same as 250 milliliters. Okay, this is now my molarity of the compound, which is the same here and here. So far, so good? Yes. Okay, so you can just calculate that. And then, to get to the next step, this is a dilution now. So the first half was really a calculation, conversion sort of question. Now we're working with dilution. Okay, M1, I'll just call this M1. It's our initial molarity that we're starting with before dilution. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we've got that check. Volume one, that's gonna be 25.00 milliliters. That's what we start with, we're gonna end with 500 milliliters. Okay. And here's my only unknown right here, but the tricky part is that's not this. That's a concentration of sodium sulfate at the end. So let me write that down. This is Na2SO4. You're not asked for that one. You're asked for sodium only. There's two sodiums in every one of these. So you got to multiply your answer of M2 by 2 to get this at the end, because there's double amount of sodiums in the solution as there is molecules of sodium sulfate. Is that okay? Yes. So it's not uncommon. I mean, this is a common question. Dilution is common. And also the concept, let's say I give you something else. Let's say it was aluminum chloride, for example. And I asked for the molarity of the chlorine. You'd find the molarity of aluminum chloride and then multiply by three to get the molarity of just the chloride ion. 